Alright, yo, what up? Welcome back to another video. So for this video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to level up faster in Rogul. But before we begin, shout out to these people for commenting and liking on my previous videos. And with that being said, let's get on to the video. You're never gonna make it, you're not good enough There's a million other people with the same stuff You really think you're different, man, you must be kidding Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it It's impossible, it's not probable, you're responsible Too many obstacles, you gotta stop it, yo You gotta take it slow, you can't be a so this video is going to be based on my experience and how I level up to max level in Rogul, which took me a really long time. These are going to be based on my experience and based on my opinion and hopefully this will help you reach max level one day in Rogul. And I'm going to probably start making more Rogul videos because I just hit max. So yeah, let's get on to the video. So before you can actually, uh, you know, grind and farm stuff like the Augear members and the CCG stuff, what you want to do is go here to the trainer if you're a ghoul. If you're a CCG, I'm going to show it later there. So you're going to go to the trainer trainer and you want to equip the Shu Sukiyama trainer here because look this is what it gives you you must have 100% progress completed to equip this on your roster so if you have it equipped on slot 1 slot 2 or slot 3 the buff is going to be like having S1 Sukiyama on your roster increases XP gain per corpse collection by 25 so like when you like kill uh, a first class investigator so here it gives you more XP, like 25 more XP. So like, it's really good for auto-clicking. Like when you're auto-clicking our gear members, it gives you more XP and it will help you level up a lot quicker. This is one of the reasons why I got to max level really fast in Rogul. So that's the first thing you want to do when you want you want to grind Augear members. So like this is the thing that I do almost all the time. I do the triangle Augear members trick. I go here, then go to the next one. The next one, I'm gonna pick up the corpse. Remember to always pick up the corpse because it gives 25 more XP when you have the Shu Sukiyama trainer on. And speaking of trainers, if you want to level up even quicker, always do trainers. Like even if you're still low level, you can always do trainers. Like there's a cooldown like 5 minutes or 10 minutes. The longest is 1 hour. Some of the trainers are really easy to do and some of it are really hard just like the Rizei Kamishiro trainer. It's a bit hard, it's a bit difficult for others but for me it's easy. It gives around like, I don't know, 30 levels, I'm not sure. Or 50 levels, it depends on your level and yeah. Just keep doing trainers if you want to level up fast and always equip the Shusukiyama trainer on slot 1, slot 2, or slot 3. So let me demonstrate the thing on the CCG on how do you level up fast in CCG. So I'm just gonna switch to CCG. So here we go, I'm on CCG now. I'm gonna click on this. So as you guys can see, I'm on CCG and look at my level. I'm level 1886. So if you guys didn't know that the Shusukiyama is also the same as Hideyoshi, the trainer of Hideyoshi. Like if you collect a corpse, you're going to get 25 more XP and I have it equipped on slot 1 and I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about. It gives more XP when you pick up some corpse. It's really easy. So yeah, watch my XP. See, it gives a lot of XP when you pick up a corpse. And just so you guys know that when you want to farm XP, always farm Algear members, not the investigators because Algear members give more XP and it gives you some RC so it's really good to farm Algear members. So that's basically it for CCG and the uh, ghouls on how to level up fast. And if you guys want to know what are the best Kagunes and what are the best Quinkes to level up with or to grind with, I'm going to show you guys. So here we go. So th for this Kagune, one of the best uh, Kagunes to level up with or to grind with is actually Noro. Because like, if you have Noro, you can like solo the Eto, Yoshimura boss, really easily. So watch how I solo this boss. When you're using Noro, you're really tanky, you're really durable, and you deal a lot of damage so you can solo Eto Yoshimura boss. See, I haven't even taken damage yet. See how fast it is? It's really easy to farm Eto with this. So if you want a Kagune that is good for farming, I recommend Noro or Takizawa because Takizawa is also good for farming and auto-clicking. I don't really recommend Noro for auto-clicking because the attack is really slow. But it's up to you if you want Noro. If you want to solo Eto. So there you go, I just soloed Eto. So for the best Queen K in uh, CCG to farm with or to level up with is actually Narukami if you're really rich on Yen. If you're low on Yen, you can like save up for the Scorpion. Scorpion is really really good for farming in CCG. Like you can kite the boss. And you can you can kill the boss really fast with scorpion because like it has burst and it's ranged and like it's really good for farming pretty much it also has a really fast attack speed so like you can auto click with it and i'm gonna show a video of the scorpion 
right now on the screen because i don't have scorpion on my ccg i have the ixa which i don't really recommend for farming but unless you have 7.5 million rc but yeah that's basically the two best uh the two best queen case for farming in ccg so i'm gonna show you guys the narukami now so i'm gonna show you guys why narukami is one of the best uh one of the best queen case for farming in ccg and if you have like tons of yen so you can buy the narukami and you can hit max level really fast so this is why i'm gonna show you guys now and credits to my friend koru because he has narukami so there he's gonna show us the skills now so there there's like a lot of range skills in narukami that's why it's really good for farming eto or kotaro amon or naishiki you know there there's tons of you know range skills in narukami that's why it's really good and yeah that's basically the two queen case i recommend for farming in ccg scorpion one out of 56 and the narukami queen case so yeah that's basically it